President. I ask unanimous consent. The Senate now proceed with consideration of Senate Resolution 186 submitted earlier today. The clerk will report. Senate Resolution 186, honoring the 100th anniversary of the United States Army Field Artillery School at Fort Sill, Oklahoma. Without objection, the Senate proceeds to the measure. I ask unanimous consent. The resolution be agreed to, the preamble be agreed to, and the motion to be considered be laid upon the table. Without objection. Mr. President, I ask unanimous consent. The Senate proceed to the immediate consideration of Senate Resolution 187 introduced earlier today. Clerk will report. Senate Resolution 187, supporting national minority health awareness, and so forth. Without objection, the Senate will proceed to the measure. Mr. President, I further ask the resolution be agreed to, the preamble be agreed to, the motion to reconsider be laid upon the table with no intervening action or debate, and that any statements relating to the measure be printed in the record at an appropriate place. Without objection. Mr. President, I ask unanimous consent that the appointment at the desk appear separately in the record as if made by the chair. Without objection. Mr. President, I ask unanimous consent that when the Senate completes its business today, it adjourn until 10 a.m. on Wednesday, May 18th. Following the prayer and pledge, the journal of proceedings be approved to date. The morning hour be deemed expired. The time for the two leaders be reserved for their use later in the day. That following any leader remarks, the Senate proceed to a period of morning business until 10.30 a.m. for debate only, with senators permitted to speak therein for up to 10 minutes each, with the time equally divided and controlled between the two leaders and the designees. Finally, that the Senate resume consideration of the motion to proceed to S-953, the Offshore Production and Safety Act, under the previous order. Without objection. Mr. President, there will be a roll call vote tomorrow around 2.30 p.m. on the motion to proceed to S-953. Additionally, this evening, the Majority Leader filed cloture on the nomination of Goodwin Liu to be a U.S. Circuit Judge for the Ninth Circuit. As a result, Senators should expect a cloture vote on the nomination sometime Thursday. And, Mr. President, if there's no further business coming for the Senate, I ask that it adjourn under the previous order. Without objection, the Senate stands adjourned until 10 a.m. tomorrow. Today in the Senate, members approved the nomination of Susan Carney to be a judge on the Second Circuit Court of Appeals by a vote of 71 to 28. Senators then voted 